Today is September 28, 2017. Lu Huaxing is 26 years old. The girl he has loved for 10 years is about to marry. He saw her in a wedding dress from WeChat Moments, but the groom is not him. But he was not disappointed, because he was about to go back and change everything. At first, he discovered that he was able to read files three months ago, because he missed the opportunity to meet her because he didn't go to the junior high school classmates, and he felt regretful. In the next blink of an eye, he returned to the junior high school classmates who invited him. That time. Since then, he has carried out many experiments on his ability, and has roughly figured out how his ability to read files works. He can read a certain time in the past and go back to that point in time to make another choice. Going back to the past is only a blink of an eye, but he must remember the clear picture at that time. If he can't remember the situation at that moment, he only knows the time. I can't go back, so I either jump to an unforgettable moment or jump to a moment in the last few days. But going back to the past will cause the butterfly effect. A little detail change will cause certain things to not happen, so you must be careful when reading files, otherwise if something good happens during this period, reading files rashly will only make these things happen. The good things are gone. But despite this, he still decided to read the file back to himself ten years ago. He is going back to the summer of the third year of junior high school, and from there he changes his life trajectory. Although many things in the past ten years may not happen, he does not care, because he has lived like in the past ten years, and the things that make him regret cannot be counted. He feels that he has no real life at all. So he has to go back to the most important point of difference in his life and start over. Go back to the school year of graduation and take a look at the girl I love deeply. For this moment, he has been preparing for many years. Of course, I used my own reading file ability. Reading files actually allows his soul to return to his own body at a certain moment in the past, which can preserve the knowledge and experience he gained in the future, so he can use this to play. For example, if he spends one year not doing anything to learn piano, he will read the files after he has learned the proficiency and go back to a year ago. The skills and experience of playing the piano are still in his mind, but it saves time and time for learning the piano. Money Repeating this process continuously, Lu Huaxing has mastered all the skills and experience. He is now proficient in three musical instruments, piano, guitar, and violin and good at four or five sports such as basketball, football, and tennis. His cooking skills have reached the level of a professional Michelin chef. In addition, there are some scattered knowledge, all accumulated in order to go back to the past. Of course, there is no way to go back to the past to bring the well-trained body back, so he has a lot of fitness knowledge and is ready to go back to the past and then exercise. Anyway, when I was growing in junior high school, the plasticity of the child's body was higher than that of adults. Since then, he can grow taller and stronger than he is now. In addition to this kind of long-distance file reading, he can also do many things through some short-distance file reading. For example, if a girl he likes gave him a multiple-choice question, and he got angry with her wrong answer, then he can choose to read the file and answer again. Another example is to fight with other people and he did not avoid the enemy's fists in time when he was hit, he could choose to read the file and return to the moment when the opponent punched and dodge in advance. In short, with this ability, as long as he is not killed by a sudden car, nothing else is a problem. Lu Waxing is ready this time, planning to live a life without regrets last time. Thinking of this, Lu Waxing took a deep breath closed his eyes and began to recall that moment. In the third year of junior high school, starting from the summer when the second year ended, they had to go back to school to make up lessons in the summer until they graduated from junior high school. It was also that year that he and Qin Yulu, the girl in his destiny, became the same table. He still remembered that day when Qin Yulu wore a snow white shirt and paired with light blue jeans sitting by the window while the teacher was not paying attention to secretly playing mobile games, her expression was lazy, and her perfect profile face looked like a fairy going down under the sunset. 
his consciousness began to blur, and he began to move away from his current body, as if he was about to fall into a dream. He knew that this was reading files, and when reading files back to a longer time point, there would be this it feels, but if you just read the file and go back a few seconds before, it's just a blink of an eye. Slowly, his consciousness began to draw closer and re-entered his body. When he opened his eyes again, a wave of heat hit his face, and what appeared in front of him was a blackboard full of words. The class name tag is hung at the door of the classroom. This was the heat wave of the summer of 2007, and Chin Yulu was sitting next to him with her cheek in one hand, and secretly playing games with her mobile phone behind the book on the table in the other. Really? It's been a long time. Lu Huaxing looked at that familiar face, and all of a sudden had mixed feelings. Chin Yulu has a delicate oval face, peach-like eyes, and a tall nose, and her long hair is plainly tied into a ponytail behind her head. The special thing about this girl lies in her snow-white skin, hazel pupils, and the faint yellow hair, which gives her a mixed-race feeling. In fact, Chin Yulu at this time is the pinnacle of her appearance. After growing up, Chin Yulu was not as good-looking as she was when she was a child, her facial features became rough, and her figure was slightly blessed, but Lu Huaxing would not let this happen, he wanted to make Chin Yulu more and more beautiful. Hey Lu Huaxing looked dumbfounded at Chin Yulu. At this time, a disgusting sarcasm sounded from behind him, and Lu Huaxing's heart suddenly sank, it's terrible, why did I forget that there was a evil star behind him? Although Chin Yulu was already very beautiful, she was still not a class flower in their class. The real class flower was the girl named Yang Xiao Xiao sitting behind him. Lu Huaxing turned his head and glanced at it. At that time, an amazing breath came to his face. Yang Xiao Xiao has a delicate face with melon seeds, and her face is so small that it can be completely covered by almost a slap. Dan Feng's eyes make her look natural and charming, and her cute little nose and fiery red lips are also irrelevant. Picky, whether separated or combined together are flawless, sweet and innocent. Even with that little demon who didn't know the relationship between men and women, Lu Huaxing was amazed by Yang Xiaoxiao's appearance, but now he looks at it from an adult's eyes, this girl is even more inexhaustible, how could there be such a thing in the world? Pretty girl? Even Yang Xiaoxiao, who is completely undressed, has a prettier face than a star, and even though he is only a junior high school student, the graceful curve has begun to take shape and has developed quite well. If Yang Xiao Xiao is dug into being a child star at this time, I am afraid that there will be nothing about Fan XX or Yang X in the future. She is definitely a female star in the entertainment industry. But despite this, Lu Huaxing is not interested in her at all, but rather disgusted because this girl is so hot and a whole girl, and this year is when she is rebellious, contradicting the teacher, puppy love, running away from home, and if you mix bad things together, you can do whatever you want. I don't know if I am happy, or simply to make my parents and teachers angry. When she first entered school, Yang Xioxio's grades were in the top five in the class, but now she has fallen below the middle. However, what Lu Huaxing dislikes is the girl's behavior and speaking style. It's a girl's family. She speaks dirty and fists at every turn. Every day after school, she mixes with those bad boys, making trouble outside and bullying herself. Even if the students who study, go to other studies to fight. Although Chin Yulu is also a pungent little girl, her pungency is just right, giving people a lively and lovely feeling. And Yang Xiao Xiao is a bomb on fire, who touches who blows. Therefore, Lu Huaxing didn't bother to talk to Yang Xiao Xiao, and turned to Qin Yulu with a smile, Yulu, the teacher saw you. Qin Yulu was amazed, and quickly held down the phone and looked at the podium. Although Qin Yulu is currently playing on mobile phones, her grades are quite good, and she is basically stable in the top three in the class. Lu Huaxing is the peak of his life in this period, but it is also the top ten in the class, and she can't keep up with Qin Yulu. After discovering that the teacher hadn't seen her playing on the phone, Qin Yulu's eyes widened and she gave him a blank look, 
then punched him the arm and continued to lower her head to play with the phone. Lu Huaxing suddenly felt nostalgic for a while, I haven't been beaten by this little fist for a long time. It's started again. Lu Huaxing thought to himself through gritted teeth, clenched his fists, and full of fighting spirit, this time, I will definitely not let my life have any regrets. If so, read the file and change it until there is no regret. I like my life to be able to read files indefinitely, please bookmark, my life can be read files infinitely. The literature is updated the fastest. In fact, there is nothing good in this era. Mobile phones have not become popular, smartphones have not yet appeared, and computers are not available in every household. Even game consoles such as GBA are relatively rare and high-end entertainment. Most children's entertainment is still limited to watching TV and FC and other TV game consoles. The old school building, the dirty concrete floor and the peeled desks all give the breath of time. There is no air conditioning in the classrooms, and only the four ceiling fans are used. We'll be sweating profusely, but Lu Huaxing still enjoys this moment. Even if he was just sitting on the side and looking at Qin Yulu's profile, he felt satisfied. Although the teacher babbled on the podium, Lu Huaxing didn't hear a word. Yulu. Lu Huaxing called out at this time, and Qin Yulu said impatiently hey, still looking down at the phone, Lu Huaxing continued, I like you for a long time. Qin Yulu was shocked, her hand shook, and her phone slammed on the table. She also looked at Lu Huaxing with wide open beautiful eyes, and said angrily, Neurotic? We are junior high school students. Sure enough, it doesn't work like this. Lu Huaxing thought to himself with a shrug. Of course, he just tried it. Maybe Qin Yulu and him have a good impression of each other? It's always okay to try it out, you can read the file again if you fail anyway. Lu Huaxing, Qin Yulu. What were the two doing in class? At this time, the teacher on the podium threw the book angrily on the podium and said. At this time, Yang Xioxio's deskmate Zhou Xiang said weirdly, Lu Huaxing said he likes Qin Yulu. There was a sudden uproar in the class, and one after another began to whisper, Qin Yulu blushed, buried her head and dare not speak. It's a bunch of little ghosts after all. Lu Huaxing sneered in his heart. At this time, the little ghosts teased each other all day by slandering the boring means of you like triple X and triple X likes you. Quiet. The teacher roared, slapped on the table, and turned to Lu Huaxing, read the text again. At this time, I'm taking English class, and the teacher Lu Huaxing is still very impressed. Her name is He Yu. She has shoulder-length hair and is plain but in good shape. She is always wearing hot clothes. She speaks. English full of dialect. She has very good qualifications, has a certificate of English level 8, married a foreign husband, and gave birth to a beautiful mixed-race child. But the students in the class hate her because she is a very irritable person, and she fists at the students when she is not happy. Both boys and girls are treated equally, and many poor students in the class have been beaten by her. Moreover, she was very ruthless. The place where the students were beaten was often swollen for one day. At this time, the system was not perfect, so this phenomenon was not contained. However, despite he use violence, she still treats students differently. Good students are basically not beaten, but they cannot escape severe scolding. Fortunately, Lu Huaxing is now a good student. After thinking about it, Lu Huaxing felt that he should not read the file anymore. After all, it was not a big deal. It was a good thing to let Qin Yulu know that he liked her. He held back this sentence for ten years, and now finally said it. Although it is not that formal, it is good for Qin Yulu to know it. If there are any negative effects after that, he can read the file again. Therefore, Lu Huaxing cleared his throat, grabbed the textbook and read fluently. From Shy Girl to Pop Star. He had passed CET6 in English before reading, and he also got an ILTS score of 8. At present, 
he can even talk to foreigners fluently and learn a little British accent, which is an English text for junior high school students. Naturally, he can't be troubled. However, such fluent English is very difficult for junior high school students. After all, students have not been exposed to English for a long time at this time. The knowledge of language requires long-term experience and familiarity through daily listening, reading, and writing. Therefore, Lu Huaxing's proficiency in English may be a bit abnormal for junior high school students. However, this result still made He Yu very satisfied. Her expression was a little slow, and she nodded and said, It seems that you have a good preview. Sit down. You are not allowed to talk any more. Get out of me if you talk. With that said, He Yu turned to the others in the class and reprimanded harshly, Look, Lu Huaxing is also a boy, don't you learn English very well? You idiots are lazy. At that time, the boys in the class looked at Lu Huaxing with hatred, and he hadn't been surprised about this. The grades of their class are at the middle and lower level in school. The boys in the class are the main dragging force. After all, it is the rebellious period of the second form. For them, Lu Huaxing has become a child of other people's family, and he is naturally affected. Many boys in the class are crowded out. Lu Huaxing didn't care about this, anyway, he didn't read files for these people. When the get out of class bell rang, Qin Yulo couldn't wait to get up and escaped from Lu Huaxing, as if afraid to talk to him. Lu Huaxing followed to the corridor outside the classroom, but the girl was gone. It seems a bit too anxious. Lu Huaxing scratched his face and sighed. At this moment, he hesitated whether to read files. Taking advantage of the short time that has passed now, reading files is the best choice, otherwise it will be over. Read the files again in two or three days, and go through these two or three days again when you come back. This is also the only risk of his ability to read files. Because of the butterfly effect, if the file is read three days ago, then in these three days, except for the specific event he wants to change, other details should keep the original track as much as possible. Otherwise it is very likely that something that would have happened later will not happen. And the best way to avoid the butterfly effect is to not read the file too long ago, read the file immediately and change it if you find something inappropriate. But when he hesitated, he suddenly thought of Mua. Behind him. Looking back, Yang Xiao Xiao gave her boyfriend a big kiss in the hallway. There were less than 30 students in the hallway who saw this scene. At that time, Lu Huaxing sneered with disgust, I really dare to do it, two junior high school students, in front of so many people. Yang Xiaoxio's boyfriend is Deng Jun, a well-known bad boy in the school. He once fought badly with other schools outside, knocked his head and beat him into the hospital, and was criticized by the whole school. But in fact, this man didn't grow up well, his eyes were small and his teeth were uneven, and his face was very poorly skinned. At first glance, he didn't match Yang Xiao Xiao at all. He also has a better figure. His height of 1.78 meters is already relatively tall among junior high school students, and he has the kind of muscle that his peers don't have. Probably because Lu Huaxing's sneer was too loud, Deng Jun stepped forward to push Lu Huaxing and asked sternly, What are you laughing at? What's so funny? Oh, don't pay attention to him, he is just a loser. When I first started class, I heard him say that he likes him at the same table, but he was rejected. Yang Xiao Xiao looked at Lu Huaxing disdainfully and sneered, Capitalize. Loser. Lu Huaxing wondered how to answer at this time to appear that he was witty and humorous, and then he was going to read the file and go back to slap Deng Jun, but at this moment Deng Jun suddenly slapped him in the face. Although Lu Huaxing reacted and raised his hand to block, he still looked a little embarrassed. Several students in his class around him snickered, waiting to watch the show. At that time, a fire rushed from Lu Huaxing's chest, he was very weak at this time, causing some things to make him feel ashamed even when he grew up thinking of it, so he will not let this situation happen again this time when he comes back from reading files. Occur. 
Lu Huaxing closed his eyes and imagined Yang Xiaoxiao's words. When she opened her eyes again, Yang Xiaoxiao sneered and threw out the phrase loser, and Deng Jun also slapped it. Because Lu Huaxing was prepared in advance, he raised his left hand and slapped Deng Jun's hand on the back of Deng Jun's hand, removed the strength of the opponent's slap, and pushed his right hand on the opponent's neck. At that time, Deng Jun clutched his neck and coughed dryly, then fell to his knees and coughed violently. Lu Huaxing stretched out his hands to hold down the back of his head, and knocked on his chin on his knees, knocking Deng Jun backwards. Lu Huaxing took advantage of this opportunity to stretch his hand on the opponent's chin, hold the opponent's back with his left hand, and put his foot on Deng Jun's bottom plate at the same time, smashing his head on the floor. Boom! With a muffled sound, Deng Jun clutched the back of his head and lay on the ground while coughing and crying, while Lu Huaxing clapped his hands sneerly and sneered, Give some sunshine to be bright, give some the floods will flood, and when you are a gangster in school, you really think you are a gangster, what's the matter? Wake up! You are a stinky kid who can't read books and fight. After speaking, Lu Huaxing took a spit. You know, he has spent several years learning free fighting. The last few strokes are not as simple as it looks. The first few strokes are a combination of military self-defense and Muay Thai, and the final blow is Aikido. More than enough to deal with this junior high school kid. But now Lu Huaxing is full of thoughts. This body, so weak. Lu Huaxing frowned as he watched his fist. It was the body of a junior high school student. Plus, he focused on learning and neglected to exercise, so his physical strength, speed, strength and flexibility were very poor. Moreover, returning to this body just from the body of an adult in his twenties, I always feel all kinds of uncomfortable. It seems that we are going to make a fitness plan tonight. Lu Waxing thought to himself, propping his chin. He wanted to build his body into the strongest body a junior high school student could have before graduating from high school. Now is the time to grow your body. The plasticity of junior high school students is very high. It is not difficult to do this. One year is enough. However, immediately after the sound of the wind rang in his ears, Lu Waxing looked up and saw Yang Xiao Xiao slap over him. He quickly leaned back to avoid him and Yang Xiao Xiao kicked his leg again, screaming angrily, You bastard! Dare to beat my man! Hat! Lu Waxing also got angry, and grabbed Yang Xiaoxiao's arm, but he didn't hold it embarrassingly. So he read the file again, and then accurately grabbed Yang Xiaoxiao's arm and looked down at her with a sneer, Smelly girl, don't think everyone likes you, and don't think everyone is afraid of you. I am not afraid of you. I also hate that you feel like nausea. After speaking, Lu Huaxing threw away Yang Xiaoxiao's hand hard and walked into the classroom angrily, while Deng Jun was still sobbing in the corridor. Other students also knew that Deng Jun was notoriously bad, and while gloating, sympathized with Lu Huaxing. Tell you, don't want to stand back home today. Yang Xiaoxiao screamed behind him, You will wait for me after school. I like my life to be able to read files indefinitely, please bookmark, my life can be read files infinitely. The literature is updated the fastest. Lu Waxing returned to his seat as usual. He didn't worry about Yang Xiaoxiao's threat at all. In fact, it didn't matter how many people came. As long as he had the ability to read files, he could play 20 by himself. After all, he can see the opponent's actions clearly and read the files back to avoid and fight back in advance. This is not the first time he has done this. He has now begun to make plans for the future. It is rare to read a file ten years ago and start over again, even if he wants to go back ten years later, he can't go back, so this time he plans to live a better life and try the road that was not tried last time. Last time he just became a good boy as his parents and teachers said, sitting at the desk and reading every day, and missed his youth, but this time he not only has to read a good book, but also enjoy his youth. However, many things are prerequisites for a strong enough body, 
so Lu Huaxing first formulated his own growth plan, getting up every morning and running 4 kilometers in the morning, and doing a set of burpee and abdominal muscle tears after returning home at night. The anaerobic training program, while strictly controlling your own diet, so that you can grow up healthy. Ten minutes passed quickly between classes, and the class bell rang before he knew it. Chin Yulu hurried in from the outside and sat down beside him. Her expression was still very cautious, she did not dare to look at Lu Huaxing. Sure enough, it's too hasty, and not enough goodwill. Lu Huaxing thought to himself, hesitating whether to read files. Chin Yulu, the girl is very simple, according to the current situation, I am afraid that she will not talk to him anymore, and may even take the initiative to ask the teacher to change positions. Lu Huaxing couldn't let this happen, so he turned to Qin Yulu. You see you are nervous. Lu Huaxing sneered, take you fun. I knew you would react like this. Qin Yulu was stunned, and then looked at him suspiciously. She may not really believe it, but she is willing to believe Lu Huaxing's words. After all, as long as she pretends to be like this, she can do something. Nothing happened. Bitch. Chin Yulu pinched a piece of meat on Lu Huaxing's arm and shook it vigorously, why are you so cheap? Hey, hey. It hurts. Lu Huaxing quickly pulled his arm back, and stared at Chin Yulu with some irritation, why is there so much effort for the stinky girl with small arms and legs? Really? Why are you so fluent in English all of a sudden? Chin Yulu stared at him suspiciously, obviously the accent was very jerky when you recite the text with me a few days ago, so now I'll, speak to those foreigners in the movie. Same. Because I went back to practice hard. Lu Waxing said half-jokingly, if you don't work hard to improve your grades, how can you continue to sit with you next time? I won't get this place next time. The last time I was confused because I caught a cold. Chin Yulu gave him a grimace, I want to sit with me, unless you can get the top three in the class. They now have a very interesting system, which is to arrange seats according to their grades. The students with the best grades sit in the front two rows. Last time, Chin Yulu did not perform well in the exam because of improper performance and his grades fell to sixth, so he sat with Lu Waxing together. Of course, occasionally the teacher will adjust according to the situation. After all, the poor students are sitting at the back and talk a little, so the first two rows are given to a dozen people with the best grades in the class, and then the teacher will make appropriate adjustments. For example, Yang Xiao Xiao, the teacher arranged to sit behind Lu Huaxing, to separate her from the students who are close to her so that she does not have so many chatters during class. This is also the difference between good students and bad students. Although it is cruel, it happens to be the epitome of this society, but it has expanded between the rich and the poor after growing up. Let's see. Lu Waxing smiled confidently. After all, he can control his own performance artificially, so it is not a problem to rank himself before or after Qin Yulu. At this time, the teacher walked into the classroom, and after the four consecutive qualities of teaching, standing up, good teacher, and sit down, they also started the class. The content in these classes was too simple for Lu Huaxing. He wanted to doze off as he listened, but he couldn't interrupt Qin Yulu's class. He could only look at the content at the back of the textbook, and he didn't know whether it was a preview or a review. Yang Xiao Xiao came in from the outside when the class lasted for more than 10 minutes, and walked in without giving a report. This class happened to be a Chinese class. The teacher was their head teacher Ren Xia, a young female teacher of 26 and 77. She was quite satisfactory in being a teacher. Although there were no highlights, there was nothing wrong with it. Go inside without reporting? Did I let you in? Ren Xiao asked angrily. Yang Xiao Xiao narrowed her lips and gave her a white look, but she didn't seem to want to collide with her today, so she returned to the door, report. What did you do? It took ten minutes for class to come. Ren Xiao asked severely. 
stomach hurts, I went to the bathroom. Yang Xiao Xiao said with an unconvinced expression looking at the ceiling with her eyes. Ren Xiao squinted at her, thinking carefully that Yang Xiao Xiao had already given her a lot of face today. This would have been a direct confrontation with her as usual, so she said impatiently, come in. Solve it sooner next time. When passing by Lu Huaxing, Yang Xiao Xiao looked at Lu Huaxing's expression as if he was about to eat him, but Lu Huaxing expressionlessly flipped through the book and pretended not to see it, and at the moment when Yang Xiao Xiao passed by him, he asked in a low voice lazily, Did you wash your hands after shit? Yang Xiao Xiao took a deep breath, gritted his teeth and said, You are dead today, then sat down in the seat, Lu Huaxing yawned exaggeratedly, showing that he was not guilty. Why did you mess with her? Qin Yulu asked suspiciously in a low voice, is she mixed up with bad things? It's okay, don't hang around outside after school, go home early, Ang. Lu Huaxing reprimanded. Qin Yulu glared at him with a frown, turned away and read the book carefully and began to listen. Lu Huaxing watched from the side and started to doze off. Finally, when school was over, Lu Huaxing began to pack his school bags, but then Yang Xiao Xiao suddenly sat down on his desk and raised her beautiful legs to his side. One, holding his arms coldly questioned, what to pack? Didn't I tell you, don't leave after school? Where do you want to go? Lu Huaxing and Qin Yulu were sitting in the fourth group, that is, by the window. Qin Yulu was next to the window. Yang Xiao Xiao raised his leg to support him, and neither he nor Qin Yulu could get out. You can't let Jia Yulu keep it. Lu Huaxing said nonchalantly. Yang Xiao Xiao looked at Qin Yulu, and put her leg down with a cold snort, hurry up. Lu Huaxing stood up and turned to Qin Yulu, waved his hand and smiled heartily, go home early and be careful on the road. You must have enough to eat and rest early after finishing your homework. See you tomorrow. Qin Yulu frowned slightly and looked a little hesitant, then turned to Yang Xiao Xiao, forget it, everyone is classmate. Don't be nosy. Yang Xiao Xiao said with a roll of eyes at her. It's okay, don't worry. Lu Huaxing smiled at Qin Yulu from behind, see you tomorrow. Qin Yulu thought for a while, decided not to be nosy, and took her school bag and left. Slowly, the students in the classroom walked around, but there were still a few boys whispering around. Lu Huaxing knew that they planned to stay and wait for the good show to gloat. Then show you a good show. Lu Huaxing stretched out and thought to himself. At this time, with a bang, the door of the classroom was kicked open. Deng Jun stood aggressively at the door, particularly handsome and coldly and proudly pointing at Lu Huaxing, and then pointing outside to let him go out. After a rough glance, there were four people behind him. Although their expressions were fierce, they were just a few junior high school students after all. Lu Huaxing wanted to laugh for a while. Go, be cruel. Yang Xiao Xiao sneered with her arms, Lu Huaxing clapped her hands, stood up and walked outside the classroom with a relaxed expression. These unscrupulous teenagers took him to the parking lot behind their school, where everyone's bicycles were parked. This reminded Lu Huaxing suddenly that at this time he seemed to be going to and from school with some friends in junior high school. He now has a childhood sweetheart named Yang Ying. However, this childhood sweetheart is not as beautiful as in the anime. His childhood sweetheart is a complete tomboy. At this time, it seems that the two people are in conflict because of something. After graduating from high school, they have not contacted each other. When he was in college, he heard that she and her family people broke off after a fight. In that environment where the older he grew, the more lonely, this kind of thing was a pity, and he decided to find a way to restore this relationship. As he was thinking, Deng Jun suddenly punched him hidden. Lu Huaxing was slightly surprised, but before he was hit, he read the gear and returned to two seconds ago. Then at the moment Deng Jun punched him, he took the initiative to greet him, grabbed the opponent's wrist with his right hand, and turned to hold Deng with his back. On Jun's chest, 
his left hand held Deng Jun's waistband back, and he jumped forward. A piggybacker dropped Deng Jun to the ground, and he was unharmed because of Deng Jun's cushion under him. And stood up. Come on, brats. Although Lu Huaxing is wearing short sleeves, he still pulls up his sleeves and said fiercely, I will teach you to be human today. I like my life to be able to read files indefinitely, please bookmark, my life can be read files infinitely. The literature is updated the fastest. Before reading the files, Lu Huaxing had a special apprenticeship to learn art, and spent a lot of money to find the actual combat skills learned by retired professional players from MMA. Although he is really not very good in actual combat, he has the ability to read files, so as long as his actions are professional enough, opportunities can be created by reading files. That's enough, it is enough to make him all disadvantaged on the battlefield. But just five little ghosts, how could he be his opponent? Children at this age have no rules at all in fighting. Basically, they are fighting with each other. With Lu Huaxing's skills and the ability to read files, he can fight ten. In terms of fighting, there is actually a big gap between laymen and insiders. The most basic thing is that laymen often use very large movements to punch their fists, expecting a punch to kill the opponent. But in actual combat, even a layman will be prepared to dodge or block such a big move, let alone an expert who has systematically studied it like Lu Huaxing. The real correct method is to use quick attacks such as jabs or straight punches to hit the enemy to create opportunities to hit the enemy with heavy attacks. This is the so-called combination boxing in boxing. The most basic combination punch is a simple three-stroke combination of right straight punch, left uppercut, and right uppercut. As the fighter's skills and experience increase, the combination punches will become more abundant, becoming four combos and even five combos, and the content of the combination will also add kicks and elbows, which is also the gap between professional boxers and laymen. When a layman and a professional boxer meet, they will be beaten decently and without resistance. It's actually quite boring to fight like this. How about some gimmicks? Lu Huaxing smiled with his waist in his waist, you are five to one, if you win, I will admit it, and I won't tell anyone about it. Don't tell the teacher, the school, or the parents. But if I win. Speaking of this, Lu Huaxing pointed to Yang Xiao Xiao next to him, you two broke up. You. Yang Xiao Xiao glared at Lu Huaxing, and her buddies hurriedly stopped him. Lu Huaxing immediately used the aggressive method. Oh, isn't our Yang Xiao Xiao usually very awesome? I told me before that you are waiting after school. Why are you afraid now? Are you not confident in your man or something? Yes. It's five dozen one. Or, I'll let another hand. Okay. Although Yang Xiao Xiao said that he had a hot temper, but was very straightforward, he was immediately fooled. Deng Jun, if none of you can beat him, Let's break up. I don't like such a useless guy. Puff. Lu Huaxing watched Deng Jun cover his mouth and snickered, My girlfriend should have come down, won't you dare to pick it up? Deng Jun sat on the ground, angrily hit the ground with a fist, stood up, and roared, Okay. Come, come. I won't be able to crawl you home if I beat you today, I won't be named Deng. Hey, that's just right. How about my surname Lu? I'll be your father. Lu Huaxing couldn't help laughing. Deng Jun looked mad, he waved to the bad guys behind him, go on, beat him to death. Anyway, we are all minors, and it is not illegal to kill. If something happens, I will stand it and give it to me. Hit to death. But even though his mouth is rampant, Lu Huaxing is now a Onian 5, so he still needs to be careful. So, he raised his hands to put his posture, his hands were on both sides of his head, his left foot was behind his right foot and his toes were slightly raised to touch the ground. This posture is the Sanomiya step in Muay Thai boxing, with both offensive and defensive postures, even laymen can feel the deterrence of this posture. Tisk, are you still pretending? A dark-skinned little fat man came forward, reached out, and grabbed Lu Huaxing. 
Lu Huaxing slapped the opponent's extended hand with his left hand, and slammed his right elbow on the chin of the little fat man. Although Lu Huaxing's body is very weak, his skills somewhat compensated for his weakness and strength, and his opponent is a 15 or 16 year old kid, everyone is of the same grade, so it is enough to deal with them. After this elbow, the little fat man's expression was a bit stunned. After shaking for two steps, Lu Huaxing hit his chin with an upper uppercut with his left hand, causing the little fat man to retreat. Lu Huaxing seized the opportunity and lifted his foot to kick the little fat man's face. The little fat man turned around and fell back to the ground, looking at his expression, there was already a mess in his head. Lu Huaxing smiled triumphantly, and raised his index finger to the three stunned people to hook and provoke. At this time, Deng Jun also stood up from the ground. Everyone at the scene was bluffed by Lu Huaxing's airs. Come on, go on. Lu Huaxing said in an angry voice, aren't you here to find the fault? Hey, go. You don't push me, you go. You called the people, Deng Jun? You are taking the lead. It's a group of little ghosts, more people hitting fewer people at the time, he seemed very hard-hearted but found that his opponent was not easy to provoke, so it was frustrated. However, Deng Jun was still a little bit fierce. He grabbed a red brick from the ground, and gritted his teeth and rushed towards Lu Huaxing. Lu Huaxing was not in a hurry, waiting for Deng Jun to come forward. After seeing the other party's brick, he went back to the file two seconds ago, and then grabbed his body at the moment Deng Jun raised the brick in his hand grabbing his wrist with one hand. Hold his elbow. Then, Lu Huaxing used an Aikido technique to control Deng Jun's power and let him knock this brick on himself. Of course, this one is not very heavy, there is no bleeding, at most, it will be over. Immediately, Lu Huaxing lifted his foot and kicked, kicking Deng Jun's abdomen to force him back. A group of laymen, still trying to fight with me here. Lu Huaxing sneered, and urged impatiently, hurry up. It's almost time for dinner at my house, let's go together. Deng Jun took the lead to greet him, and when he saw the three bad things, he revived his courage thanks to the crowd. But in terms of playing, no one has his reading ability. He waited until the opponent attacked to see their attack routines, and then read the files back to five seconds before sorting out the next attack in his mind ideas. Therefore, Deng Jun just rushed to him and raised his hand. Before he attacked, Lu Huaxing used the momentum of turning to hit his chin with an elbow. Muay Thai's elbow was very deadly. Because the opponent was also a child, the impact of this level was already very strong, and Deng Jun's expression was straightforward, and he fell to the ground. Then Lu Huaxing greeted the person behind, and after a short run-up, a flying knee hit the second person's chin. The second person covered his mouth and fell to the ground, rolling in pain. Just as they were about to deal with the remaining two people, the momentum of the two men's forwards came to an abrupt end, and then they turned and ran. Hey! Why did you run away? Lu Waxing was angry and chased them two steps, but when the two people saw it, they quickened their pace and slipped away from the parking lot. Lu Huaxing symbolically chased after them. Just a few steps. The scene fell silent for a while, and then Lu Huaxing suddenly turned to the boys who were left in their class to watch the good show, and then approached them aggressively, Damn, it's your turn next. Normally the other people in the joint class push me out, right? Don't run. Even fight with you. But those boys have been completely frightened by Lu Huaxing's hands. Normally they are definitely not afraid of Lu Huaxing. However, Lu Huaxing hit three people at once, and even the bad boys were scared away. They naturally, he felt a panic in his heart, and quickly turned around and ran away. Lu Huaxing became even more angry as soon as they ran, and ran after him. While chasing him angrily, damn, don't run. Isn't it arrogant at ordinary times? Don't you always want to beat me? What run? But to be honest, Lu Huaxing's physical strength has bottomed out now, he just did it, 
and stopped after running two steps. Muay Thai is very explosive, and it consumes physical strength. With his current physical ability, it is only so much. All the people at the scene ran away, leaving only the few still on the ground, as well as Yang Xiao Xiao and her buddies. Congratulations, I'm back to single again from today. Lu Huaxing turned to Yang Xiao Xiao and smiled. He tried his best to keep his breath not too fast, but he was already sweating, you should be a bad person. It's a failure, why don't you pick up the books and study again? Yang Xiaoxio's brows trembled, gritting his teeth at him like an angry cat, while Lu Huaxing became more proud and walked towards the classroom, oh, go back to eat. Everyone, go home early for dinner, too. Don't hang around outside at this night. A group of laymen who don't know how to fight, why not behave badly? Why don't you go practice sports? Comfortable. Lu Waxing sighed in contentment and thought to himself, at this moment, he felt that it was really worth it to come back from the file. I like my life to be able to read files indefinitely, please bookmark my life can be read files infinitely. The literature is updated the fastest. Although I knew that fighting was not good in my heart, Lu Huaxing was still in a great mood when he rode back, because he couldn't measure right or wrong for some things. When I was young, the teacher said that good children can't fight, and they need to tell the teacher what happened, but the truth is that telling the teacher is no use. After being beaten, telling the teacher will only look like a loser and it will only lead to revenge from the beater. He still remembers that when he was in elementary school, he was beaten and cried by his classmates. When his father came to pick him up from school, he reprimanded, You also beat me back. At that time, he simply said to his dad, The teacher said that good children can't fight, and now he wants to come to his dad to say it is correct. Fighting is not right, but is it right to avoid the problems before you? As a man, sometimes there are some problems that you can't escape, even if it is wrong, you have to deal with it. Especially when facing bullying, the more you avoid the bullying, the more you will come to the door. Telling the teacher will only make the bullying continue again and again. In this fight, Lu Huaxing was actually not so comfortable. His boxing peak hurts so much. After all, the child's skin is tender and his body has not undergone special training. The intense collision caused his skin to wear out. And the muscles of the whole body are weak and weak. You have to stretch it well when you go back, otherwise the muscles will be sore and unbearable tomorrow. Riding the bike and feeling the summer heat, Lu Waxing's thoughts suddenly drifted away. He was too old to remember what kind of life he was living at home at this time only vaguely remembered that his family still lives in the old house. Ten years later, their old house has been demolished and rebuilt, and their family has moved to a new house. But the process is quite tortuous. In those few years, his mother El Yujing suffered a lot. Because the family's savings were not enough, she could only buy a house outside the Third Ring Road. The shuttle bus from his father's factory was basically unaffected, but his mother to get back to work from there, you can only get up at 5 o'clock in the morning and drive back to the city center at 6 o'clock in the morning and go back to the city center at 7 o'clock in the evening. After dinner, you will go to bed again at 9 o'clock. Not a few words. After that, the old house was demolished and rebuilt. Their family sold the house outside the Third Ring Road and moved back to the city, and the family's life was finally a little better but all this was part of his mother's hard work. A little bit of boiled out. Lu Waxing really felt sorry for his mother, so he made some preparations before coming back this time. He deliberately remembered the first prize of the two-color ball in a certain period after he came back, and then prepared to buy a number as the case may be. The house price this year is not so exaggerated. About 300,000 to 400,000 yuan can buy a large house in a very good location, so you don't need to win 5 million, 200,000 will do. The first prize should be about 2 or 3 bets. Winning 5 million will easily provoke the culprit's mind, and it will also make his dad think of the extra money. His dad is good at everything. He just likes to trade stocks. 
After losing money again and again, he is not smart enough. He throws some spare money into stocks to do charity. Therefore, the amount of 200,000 is just right, and it is used to pay the down payment for the house, and the loan can be paid off within a few years. And a middle 5 million may actually make their family get something for nothing. Anyway, with the ability to read files and the ability to do this, Lu Huaxing feels that making some money shouldn't be difficult. When he returned home downstairs, Lu Huaxing looked up at this dilapidated six-story old alley, feeling a lot in his heart. This red brick house was almost disappearing from his memory, but even though the buildings in this community were dirty and broken, but it is where he grew up. Missing his childhood, Lu Huaxing went upstairs and walked through the dark corridor. When he returned home, it was exactly five to six. It's still a summer makeup class. School is over at five in the afternoon. His normal home time is almost 5.20. But today, he wasted a lot of time with this group of bad guys, so he didn't get home until almost 6. Oh, where did you go today? Really, I came back so late and didn't even call home. At this moment, a woman with a slightly blessed figure and a very gentle and graceful temperament came on her face and pinched Lu Waxing's face. Scolded. Lu Waxing almost forgot what his parents looked like at this time. They were once so young, but they were a lot older after ten years. This sharp contrast made Lu Waxing feel a lot, and he blinked and teared his eyes. Hold back, and then grinned, Mom. You are so beautiful. Dad is also very handsome. Tisk, what do you want to buy again? Lu Waxing and his father Lu Swibin didn't get angry but he still made a laugh. Dad, I will help with housework every day from now on. Can I give me ten dollars in pocket money? Lu Huaxing asked with a smile. By King City, where Lu Huaxing is located, is a second-tier city, and ten years later, it will still be a second-tier city. Therefore, four thousand a month is considered a high income in this era. Ten yuan a day of pocket money may be dismissive for children ten years later. Goo, but this is really not a small sum at the moment. Even if Lu Waxing has knowledge, he is only a junior high school student, so pocket money is very necessary for him. Usually the family only gives him three to five yuan a day to eat, but such a small amount is enough to eat breakfast outside. How much money do you have to buy lottery tickets? Fortunately, he is more sensible at this time and his grades are quite good. The family members are more used to him. Yes, but you can do a little bit more, just dragging and sweeping the floor perfunctorily. Lu Swipin said while eating. Well. I will be responsible for washing the dishes and taking out the trash. Is this always okay? Lu Waxing stroked the old table in front of him, feeling the familiar feel and smell and laughed. He ate at this table. For more than ten years of rice. Later, when I moved, because the table was too old, it broke during the move, but his grandmother left this table. Don't delay your study. L. Yu Jing frowned and said solemnly, you will be in the third grade right now. After school starts, there will be a night for self-study. It is okay to give you more pocket money. Just do the housework. You can study hard. Don't fall back. It's okay, Mom. I'll do it and I won't delay studying. Lu Waxing said confidently. Mom is coming over for dinner this Sunday, so let's go buy some food and come back. Lu Swipin whispered to L. Yu Jing at this time. Yeah, I see. L. Yu Jing replied, while Lu Waxing took a few deep breaths, as if a piece of her heart had been dug out, his grandma is still alive at this time. The year his grandmother worked after graduating from university, she died of a sudden cerebral hemorrhage. She was rescued in the ward for several days, but her symptoms were too severe to maintain her life without the aid of equipment, and she did not get better. Hope. In addition, their family couldn't afford more than 10,000 medical expenses a day in the intensive care unit. In the end, his father could only make a decision. Before that, Lu Waxing never thought that the hardest decision in life would be a pipe. 
His grandmother is a bit stubborn and often quarrels with his parents. Her temper is a bit stubborn and withdrawn, but she is very good to him. After retirement, she still goes out to do some cleaning work, just to buy him something he likes to eat. His grandma's biggest wish was to see him get married and then embrace the great-grandson, but it was a pity that Lu Huaxing did not satisfy her wish in the end. And ironically, the last week of his grandma's life in the ward was the week that Lu Huaxing spent the most time with her, which made him especially guilty. But now his grandma is still alive, this time he must let her grandma see him getting married and having children. Their family is such an ordinary and happy family. Although there is no money, there is no contradiction. The family loves each other, and it is a happy family that many people envy. After eating, Lu Huaxing washed the dishes, because although computers are not uncommon these years, they are not available in every household. So entertainment is just watching TV, but Lu Huaxing has more important things to do. Just after a fight with a group of bad guys today, he simply did a stretch to relieve muscle fatigue and avoid muscle soreness tomorrow. Then he went to bed early, got up at 6 o'clock in the morning, went downstairs and jogged in the courtyard of the community for 40 minutes, went home and took a shower, then bought breakfast, and drove to school on his bike. Before leaving the community, he saw a girl with shoulder-length short hair pushing a bicycle out of the unit. The girl had good features, but she had dark skin and a tall head. With this hairstyle, she looked and boys are no different. This is his childhood sweetheart, Yang Ying, who has been playing together in the same class in the building next door since kindergarten. Her dad always wanted a son, but he gave birth to a daughter, so he raised her as a son, and she developed this character. Morning. Lu Huaxing greeted Yang Ying with a refreshing smile. In fact, the relationship between the two of them was a lot rusty at this time. The reason is ridiculous. It's just that Lu Huaxing and Yang Ying spend too much time together. They go to school and school together, and they play together on holidays. So those scumbags in the class say they are the gossip between the two caused them to alienate each other deliberately, but there is actually no contradiction between them. When I was young, I would care about these gossips, but it was ridiculous from the eyes of an adult. He didn't want to alienate his childhood for such boring reasons. Seeing Lu Huaxing greeted her enthusiastically, Yang Ying also smiled at him. Let's go to school together. Lu Huaxing nibbled at the fried dough sticks and said, By the way, how many do you have for the crispy noodles? Give me a few, I'm almost ready to get a set. Yang Ying followed up by bike and snorted, That can't be for nothing you can change it for more. After all, there is no contradiction between the two people, they are all caused by gossip. After only a few words, they regained their previous relationship, and the child is like this. With such a calculation, Lu Huaxing found that there is really a lot to do when he comes back this time, so he has to make a good calculation. The layout at the beginning of the game is very important, and the reading point should be set up in time to avoid accidents in the future. The fragments of reading files must be carefully planned at this time. I like my life to be able to read files indefinitely, please bookmark, my life can be read files infinitely. The literature is updated the fastest. When they arrived at the school, Lu Huaxing and Yang Ying parked the car and went to the classroom together. Oh, Lu Huaxing and Yang Ying came to school together again, Lu Huaxing must like Yang Ying. At this time, a boy in the class said with a strange yin and yang. Lu Huaxing glanced at him diagonally. This guy is called Jian Jian. He has a slightly fat body and average appearance. He has average grades in the class, but he paints well. Because Lu Huaxing happened to like him in the second semester of junior high. One of the girls is at the same table, and then this guy starts to make his rumors frantically, every time he sees him, it is yin and yang. Lu Huaxing glanced at him and slapped him in the face when he went up. Wow! There was a sudden uproar in the classroom. The students looked at Lu Huaxing in horror as if they didn't know him at all, and Qian Jian was also in a daze. Lu Huaxing glanced at the students at the scene. 
Everyone seemed very scared of him, especially the boys who witnessed the War of the Century last night. Then Lu Huaxing looked at Qin Yulu on the seat again, Qin Yulu forgot about halfway through getting the book, just staring at him blankly. Lu Huaxing held his chin in thought, well, it seems that this approach is still undesirable. It does not conform to my previous style. The changes are too great for everyone to accept. Lu Huaxing was still a good student in the class at this time, and this violent behavior was more like a bad boy. Of course, the slap in the face made me feel relieved. Therefore, Lu Huaxing chose to read the file and went back to the classroom. Oh, Lu Huaxing and Yang Ying came to school together again, Lu Huaxing must like Yang Ying. Qian Jiaoan said strangely. And Lu Huaxing replied without thinking, You came to school with your mother again this morning. You must also like your mother very much. These words immediately made Qian Jiaoan stunned, his face flushed, and he faintly replied, That, that's my mother. Oh, this is my childhood. Lu Huaxing turned to Yang Ying and introduced, I have been in the same class with her since kindergarten. Yang Ying pursed her lips behind him and laughed, and then Qian Jiaoan said in vain, What's wrong with coming to school together? Are you jealous because no one goes to school with you? Because Yang Ying is a tomboy, she is very popular among the girls in the class. When she speaks like this, someone will come out to help her. Several girls sneered at the side, that's why he went to school with his mother. In fact, Lu Huaxing feels very uncomfortable when he develops here, which shows that some bullying is included. Although Jian Jiaoan said that his personality is a bit weird, he has nothing wrong with his life, and because of some weird behaviors of Jian Jiaoan in the past, he was excluded from the class. He was basically in the same situation as Lu Huaxing at the time. Lu Huaxing suddenly felt a little sympathetic now. He. Forget it. Don't say that. Lu Huaxing patted Jian Jiaoan on the shoulder and persuaded the girls, people will make friends in the future. What we are doing now will not determine who we are in this life. Don't look at the fact that Jian Jiaoan is unpopular now, maybe he will grow up to be a male god? I advise you to keep your words, maybe you still have a chance to chase people in the future. Hey, get out of here. The girls said irritably, but they were also amused by Lu Huaxing, and Qian Jiaoan was a little bit unconvinced, I, I will make friends in the future. Wait and see. That's what happened. Lu Huaxing felt that the result was perfect, and there was no need to read files. So he came to the seat, sat down beside Qin Yulu, and began to dig out the book. You last night, those bad boys. Qin Yulu looked at him with some worry and asked. Oh, we had a good exchange. Lu Huaxing said, and glanced at Yang Xiao Xiao, who was on the back of his face. It turns out that they are not unreasonable. They are actually very good at talking under certain circumstances. I persuaded them, and they found out that they were doing something wrong. Yang Xiaoxio's boyfriend also realized the mistake of her puppy love and decided to break up with her. Qin Yulu turned to look at Yang Xiao Xiao in surprise, and the expression on Yang Xiaoxio's face looked like an angry lioness, staring at Lu Huaxing as if to eat him. Lu Huaxing became more proud, it's great, isn't it? Student Yang Xiao Xiao. After all, the prodigal son will not change his head after all. I am really happy for him. You are less proud. Yang Xiao Xiao slapped on the table, angrily tell you, this is not over yet. Oh. Lu Huaxing looked indifferent, spread the textbook on the book, and Yang Xiao Xiao ran out of the classroom. But Lu Huaxing actually knew that Yang Xiao Xiao couldn't make any big storms. At best, she was mixed up with those bad things, not really bad. It was her boyfriend Deng Jun's face that people would take care of her. Now that Deng Jun has no face, how can anyone help her? You must know that there are some rules in bad things. To put it bluntly, people have to spend money. For example, Deng Jun called four brothers to come over to help last time. It is reasonable to ask everyone to have a drink and something to eat. 
Each person costs more than 10 or 20 yuan, which adds up to nearly 100. At the very low end of the year, how can the average junior high school student get 100 yuan every day? You know, breakfast is only 2 yuan at this time. Soon the class bell rang, and Lu Huaxing was very sleepy because he was jogging for 40 minutes in the morning. After all, this body was still a child's body, and it was the first time to run such a long distance. It stands to reason that morning jogs can make people feel refreshed and refreshed, but this effect can only be achieved after his body slowly adapts. It's summer tuition, so they don't have gym classes. It's important for him to keep an appropriate amount of exercise. He is taller and stronger than himself in the last archive. Ren Xia, their head teacher and Chinese teacher, knocked the book on the podium after saying sit down, and then solemnly announced the bad news. The day after tomorrow is the monthly exam of this month, so today we have to one mock test. Nowadays, they have graduated from the second grade and entered the third grade, and from the third grade to their junior high school graduation, monthly exams will be held every month to let them get used to the rhythm of the high school entrance exam and to review the knowledge they have learned. As soon as the voice fell, there was a wailing in the class, and even Qin Yulu was worried. Chinese is the only relatively weak subject in all her disciplines, but Lu Huaxing doesn't care anymore, regardless of his own language level. With his ability to read files, he didn't worry about the exam at all. The easiest way is to wait for the paper to be issued, look at the title of the test paper, and then read the file back before the paper is issued. The moment Ren Xia enters the classroom, he can find the answer to the question by looking through the book. He only needs to write down the answers to some fill in the blank questions, and reading comprehension and composition are completely adequate for his college Chinese level. However, today is just a mock test which is not worth mentioning. The monthly test after this is the key. One thing Lu Huaxing should pay attention to is the timing of file reading. With the content of the third grade textbook, it is not difficult for him to get a high score, but after so long, there may be some things he can't remember, and he has to control his score so that his ranking is just before Qin Yulu. It is convenient to arrange seats, so the timing of reading files is particularly important. The good news is that the monthly exam will be completed in one day, and the timing of his reading is not high. He only needs to prepare two reading times. The first one is before the start of the first exam, if he is not familiar with the content of the exam he can read the file after knowing the question after the exam, and then hold back to get a high score, as for the second one, it is before the start of the last subject, this is to facilitate his control of his score. Waiting for the second day of the monthly exam, the results and rankings in the class came out, he read the file again and returned to the last subject of the monthly exam, adjusted his total score, and he could achieve his goal. If you read the file too early, you have to repeat it for a few days. This is actually very painful, so the timing of the file reading must be controlled artificially. Thinking of this, he is already ready, and the next step is to deal with the review and mock exams these days. However, this exam is just a quiz with two classes connected together. It is not a formal exam, so it is not particularly formal. Many poor students are already preparing to cheat. Lu Huaxing moved his ten fingers, took the test paper from the teacher, handed it to Qin Yulu, and then passed it back, and began to check the content of the test paper. It took ten minutes to glance at it roughly. After confirming the questions to be tested, Lu Huaxing read the files again and returned to the time before issuing the test papers. When Ren Xia announced to the class the time of the monthly test, the order of the test subjects and the precautions, he took out read the textbook carefully. After memorizing as many answers as possible, Lu Huaxing nodded in satisfaction, and took the test paper from Ren Xia for the second time, handed it to Qin Yulu, and then passed it back. But this time, he simply immersed himself in answering the test paper. I like my life to be able to read files indefinitely, please bookmark, my life can be read files infinitely. The literature is updated the fastest. Because this was just a test in class, Lu Huaxing didn't take it to heart. 
As long as the test scores are pasteable, there is no need to read the files repeatedly to see the answers. After all, I read too many files, and it's really boring to spend too many times in the same plot. It's not like a game that can skip the repeated time directly. Except for the quizzes in a few classes, Lu Huaxing spent the rest of the time wondering how to spend the class time. Although he was satisfied to be able to appreciate Qin Yulu's pretty face silently on the side, she would feel awkward and wasted time watching Qin Yulu all the time, so Lu Huaxing decided to spend the class time to do something else. He made sufficient preparations before returning. Now he is proficient in three sports, free kicking, football and basketball, three musical instruments, guitar, violin and piano, and various cooking methods. On the one hand, he is to better chase Qin Yulu, on the other hand. I also want to try a job I haven't tried in my previous life. For example, to be a professional athlete, or a musician or a chef, he hasn't thought about it yet but because it's not suitable to read the file too long ago, he has to experience it himself in the middle of the time, so he can only shop for himself in advance. A good road, there are many roads for him to choose, such as winning various awards at the municipal or even national level. In this way, he can choose whether he wants to become a musician or an athlete in the future. If he finds it inappropriate or doesn't like it after trying, he only needs to read the file and go back to the time when he made a decision half a year ago, instead of five or six years ago. You can quickly choose a future that suits you. After mastering these skills, Lu Huaxing wants to try other things, such as cartoonists, doctors, or lawyers. However, he really couldn't stand the profession of a doctor. On the one hand, because the operation was too bloody, on the other hand, he was too emotional to get used to life and death. The depressive atmosphere of the hospital would overwhelm him. As for the work of a lawyer, Lu Huaxing is a man with a strong sense of justice. He can't handle the guilt of guilty people or fight for commutation. After thinking about it, the manga artist may be the only thing he is interested in. So when he was in class, he began to draw on the books, either by drawing some comic characters, or by changing the illustrations in the book. It was surprisingly interesting, such as adding up the portrait of Du Fu and adding armor. This way, it also eases the boring time of class. The day's course was over, and Lu Huaxing stretched out to pack his school bags and leave. Where are you going? It's our team's turn to do the cleaning today. Yang Xiao Xiao held Lu Huaxing in a huff. Ah! Lu Huaxing was stunned almost forgetting this. The cleaning is the whole group, that is, their group is responsible. Qin Yulu's group is tomorrow. He wanted to find an excuse to go home with Qin Yulu. Oh, that's... Lu Huaxing sighed anxiously, and was not upset again, so he turned to Qin Yulu and asked with a smile, Yulu, wait for me to finish cleaning and go back together? You are not today's text. Didn't you understand? I'll teach you. Who wants you to teach it? Qin Yulu snorted and picked up her school bag, remember to clean the classroom. Lu Huaxing's face sank at the time, and then took a deep breath, read the file. Yulu, wait for me to go after school? Today I have a question that I didn't understand, I want to ask you. Lu Huaxing asked with a different way of saying, and Qin Yulu stuck out her tongue at him, stupid it's dead, go ask the teacher. This stinky girl. Lu Huaxing gritted his teeth and thought to me, you remember it. I'll catch you after you catch you. The relationship between him and Qin Yulu is like this. When I was young, I didn't understand the love between men and women. The two people always quarreled, and it was normal that they couldn't change it for a while. Then. Qin Yulu left the classroom with another girl. The girl was called Ye Jixin. She was not pretty, she was slightly fat, and her skin was slightly dark, but she was gentle and demure, and she was a girl who was very suitable to be a wife. Now Ye Jixin and Qin Yulu are not actually friends. Their relationship has only gradually improved since the third year of junior high. Before that, think about Qin Yulu's loneliness. 
she has a good relationship with anyone, but none of them is special. Close friends, unlike Lu Huaxing, at least Yang Ying is a childhood sweetheart. In the past, Qin Yulu always went to school alone. Until the third year of junior high school, because they had to study late at night, they had to go to 8 o'clock in the evening to go home. It was too unsafe for junior high school students, so the students went together as much as possible. At that time, Qin Yulu and Ye Jiaxin's the relationship is getting better and better, becoming good friends who go to school together. But then a lot of very complicated things happened. Tisk, let's go, let's go. This girl. Lu Huaxing muttered to Qin Yulu's leaving back with his arms akimbo. At this moment, he suddenly saw the other two boys in the group preparing to stray, and immediately stepped forward and grabbed them. Hey, where are you going? Has the cleaning been done? It's about you percent number yen. The boy waved away Lu Huaxing's hand in a bad mood. This guy is called Zhou Bao Ei. He is a fat man with a weight of 1.75 meters and a weight of 180. He has been particularly dissatisfied with Lu Huaxing since the first day of the junior high school. The reason is simple. He thinks Lu Huaxing is a special pretend person and thinks Lu Huaxing learning well is just to please the teacher, which is similar to the reason most boys hate him. However, Zhou Baoyi's performance has always been particularly obvious. Once Lu Huaxing didn't pay attention to stepping on his bench. This guy came up and kicked his leg away. Originally, Lu Huaxing didn't care much about things after more than 10 years, so he didn't deliberately teach anyone when he came back this time, but this guy's current attitude really made him very popular. Therefore, Lu Huaxing read the file and returned to the moment Zhou Bowie I waved his arm. When the opponent waved, he held his shoulder with one hand grabbed Zhou Baoyi's wrist with the other, twisted his arm to his back, and then pressed his he slammed his head on the table and said coldly, You are gone, it's not your father that I do. It doesn't matter who I am? Hey! You, I! Zhou Baoyi struggled, but the more he struggled, the more pain his arm hurts, and he just felt that he couldn't help it. Lu Waxing uses grappling, which is similar in technique to Aikido. He controls Zhou Baoyi's joints and suppresses his center of gravity. His strength is not enough, so it is impossible to get it. Of. But there was another person with Zhou Baoyi, the boy named Chen Liang. The relationship between him and Lu Huaxing in junior high school was very delicate, sometimes good and bad. Of course, Chen Liang has always disliked Lu Huaxing but his attitude is very good when he needs Lu Huaxing to borrow him to copy homework or pass the answers in the exam, but at other times he will be very unfriendly, especially after the exam is over. Period and Lu Huaxing fought several times. However, Chen Liang is 1.78 meters tall, while Lu Huaxing is only 1.68 meters old. He is short of his opponent by more than half, so he has never won a fight. It's just that the situation is different after reading the file. Chen Liang came forward and prepared to help. He stretched out his hand and grabbed Lu Huaxing's neck. Lu Huaxing first put his foot under Zhou Baoyi's feet, causing Zhou Baoyi to lose his balance and fall on the table, then stretched out his right hand and grabbed Chen Liang's wrist. Twisted his thumb with his left hand and smashed it backwards, taking advantage of Chen Liang's pain and screaming lifting his foot to the side of his knee. Chen Liang knelt to the ground with one knee and rammed into Lu Huaxing's arms. Lu Huaxing used this momentum to press his chin and push back. Chen Liang suddenly lost his balance completely and fell back. Ground. It's easy. Lu Huaxing clapped his hands and said, Honestly get back and do. However, the two men looked at Lu Huaxing as if they saw a ghost, and hurried away after getting up. Clean. Lu Huaxing looked at the back of the two people leaving, said the last word with a flat expression, and fell into silence. He was hesitating to read files, it didn't work at all, let the two rascals run away. There are only six people in a group. When these two ran away, he and three other girls were left. And one of them is Yang Xiao Xiao, 
and now she hates Lu Huaxing to death. Where did you learn this? Yang Xiao Xiao looked at Lu Huaxing in disgust and asked. On TV. Lu Huaxing took a deep breath and said patiently. He decided not to read files anymore. After all, the same plot would be very annoying after three times, but with two people missing, the cleaning task was assigned to other people. Fortunately, the classroom is not big, nor is it at my own home. I just need to perfunctorily. I should be able to finish and leave before half past five. I'm leaving now. Yang Ying pushed her bicycle by the door of the classroom at this time, and said in her head. Wait for me. Twenty minutes will be fine. Lu Huaxing said unwillingly. I will miss the little dragon club in twenty minutes. There is a double dragon today. Yang Ying said, getting on the bike and leaving. What kind of people are you? Lu Huaxing said a little bit unhappy. Because of the fight between Lu Huaxing and Zhou Baoyi just now, the remaining two girls seemed to be afraid of Lu Huaxing at the moment. After finishing their watering and sweeping tasks, they hurriedly left. For a while, only him was left in the classroom. And Yang Xiao Xiao. It's embarrassing. Lu Huaxing couldn't help thinking to himself, and Yang Xiao Xiao didn't bother to look at his angry expression. However, there was a loud bang behind him, and the door of the classroom was kicked open. A dark-skinned boy with an open black shirt and ripped jeans was standing at the door with a long Aotian expression on his face. Inside the classroom. Long time no see, Lu Huaxing. The boy looked at Lu Huaxing, pointed outside and said, Come out and talk. This person, Lu Huaxing, also knows him. He is Zheng Zhi, a classmate of his elementary school, but he is in different classes after junior high school, because this guy is notoriously fond of fighting, and he is extremely cruel, he is the bad boss of their school. No wonder you stayed patiently with me till now. Lu Huaxing glanced at Yang Xiao Xiao and sneered. Yang Xiao Xiao just threw a gloating expression, but Lu Huaxing didn't panic at all, there is something you like to see. I like my life to be able to read files indefinitely, please bookmark, my life can be read files infinitely. The literature is updated the fastest. In fact, Lu Huaxing thought it was weird before. Yang Xiao Xiao hated him so much but was willing to stay here with him so late to do the cleaning, which made it clear that something was wrong. Thinking about it now, it should be Yang Xiao Xiao who told Deng Jun that he was going to stay for cleaning today, and then these bad boys took advantage of this time to stop him. Oh, I'm going home late again today. Lu Huaxing said with a sigh, but he was not afraid. Zheng Zhi is indeed the boss of this bad schoolboy, he is notoriously cruel. Children of this age, to put it bluntly, fight is to see who is cruel, and who can be cruel to kill is who is strong, and Zheng Zhi is such a bad thing. In fact, many people have the idea of these ills, I am a minor, even if I kill someone, I will not be sentenced. At most I just throw it into the juvenile control office. It is precisely because of this idea that these little ghosts are arrogant and lawless, but in fact these are manifestations of ignorance. But as long as it's a fight, Lu Huaxing is not afraid. He can read files anyway. The big deal is to read files a few more times. One time he can achieve no injury. However, after coming out of the classroom, Lu Huaxing discovered that 30 or 40 people had arrived. This worries him a little bit. His current body is too weak and his physical strength is too poor. It is impossible to deal with these 30 or 40 people, but he can always find a way to read more files. After all, these people on the scene are little ghosts. Once they start fighting, they will be shocked by Lu Huaxing's skills. Perhaps some people are really lawless and dare to kill people but most of them are gangsters. They are bad only because of their achievements. It's not good. Mixing up with the bad can make you look cool, at least Yang Xiao Xiao has this idea. I heard that you are very arrogant lately. Zheng Zhi put his arms around Lu Huaxing's shoulders, and said sternly at the flowers and grass beside him, 
his temperament was like the big brother of the club who came to talk to his younger brother. Lu Huaxing couldn't help laughing, puff. Upon seeing this, Zhang Ji frowned and turned to look at Lu Huaxing, as if threatening him not to laugh. But even though he made a horrible expression as much as possible, Lu Huaxing still felt naive, so he sighed and said, Really, don't do that. Do you think you are scary? Hey? With your shirt open, wear a pair of ripped jeans and look different. Please, you are just like everyone else. Zhang Zhi raised his brows and looked at him. He didn't rush to do anything, but sneered, You have become seated. People will always grow up. Lu Huaxing waved his hand and smiled disapprovingly, You should also grow up. Do you think you are amazing? Hey! Zhang Zhi stretched out his hands and pushed Lu Huaxing. This force was a bit fierce. Lu Huaxing staggered back two steps before stabilizing. In terms of physical fitness, Zhang Zhi was much stronger than him. Strong muscle lines were vaguely visible under the open shirt. For a child of this age it is not easy. Do you think that you study well and fight very hard, hey? Zhang Zhi said and was about to reach out to push Lu Huaxing, but Lu Huaxing avoided, raised his index finger and pointed at Zhang Zhi and said, I warn you. Push me, I am going to fight back. Fight back. Zhang Zhi snorted and raised his hand to stop the bad things around him, don't say I bully you, today I'll be Oneonun with you, and I'm going to punch you out. Lu Huaxing watched him silent for a while. Zhang Zhi was all the bad boss in this school. He fought, at least in the case of head subs, he has never had an opponent. No one can beat him. This is why he can be the boss. S reason. He wondered if he could take advantage of this. Although he was not afraid of these punks coming to the door to make trouble, it was still annoying to come here every day. Lu Huaxing stretched out his hands, sighed and pretended to be helpless, don't don't don't, you'd better ask a few people to help you, in case you lose face in front of so many people. You are these bad bosses, if you singled out and lost. Tsk tsk tsk. You can beat me in singles. I will give you this position. Zhang Zhi pointed at Lu Huaxing and said with a grin, while Lu Huaxing smiled from the bottom of his heart, it is really easy to be fooled if it is a child. Zhang Zhi raised his hand and shouted, you all retreat and let me fight him one oh none. The unscrupulous teenagers at the scene retreated one after another, leaving an open space for Lu Huaxing and Zhang Zhi. Zhang Zhi stared at Lu Huaxing fiercely, and Lu Huaxing was thinking about how to solve this head-sub match neatly and neatly. Then Zhang Zhi leaped at him, leaped into the air and kicked up. Seeing his action, Lu Huaxing suddenly had an idea, so he read the file and returned to the moment Zhang Zhi pounced on him three seconds ago. Lu Huaxing also took the initiative to greet him. Then, Zhang Zhi leaped up into the air, and a flying kick came up, but Lu Huaxing also jumped up avoiding the opponent's kick and putting his right hand on his neck, and using his own gravity to RKO Zhang Zhi fell to the ground. RKO is a skill in wrestling. It is very enjoyable, especially in the case of the scene. Two people bump into each other, and then one party uses RKO to fall to the ground. This scene is like a wrestler. The game has a strong visual impact. But Lu Waxing regretted it after using it. He and Zhang Zhi fell to the ground together, suffering a sharp pain in their backs. Although RKO is highly admirable, it is more just for admiration rather than actual combat. It is used to perform in the wrestling arena. It is a technique that hurts the enemy by 1,800, so although Zhang Zhi fell on the ground, but he himself fell hard enough. But in order to be handsome, he could only endure it, so he immediately got up. Zhang Zhi is also very tenacious. After this fall, he did not admit defeat, but got up and punched again. At this time, Lu Huaxing hadn't figured out what to do next, so he avoided it, and then thought of a handsome ending, so he read the file again and returned to the moment when Zhang Zhi got up and punched. Because he already knew the opponent's fist through reading files, Lu Huaxing raised his hand and grabbed Zhang Zhi's fist, 
tugged him hard to make him lose his balance, then lifted his foot on the side of his knee and kicked Zhang Zhi down on one knee. And finally stepped on his supporting leg and jumped up. With the momentum of falling, he slammed his elbow on Zhang Zhi's head and ended the battle. Zhang Zhi snorted and threw his head to the ground. He didn't faint, his eyes were still open, but he was stunned. But the surrounding people said in horror, beat, killed someone. He killed Zhang Zhi. Shut up, idiot. Lu Huaxing interrupted him angrily, he is just stunned, is he still moving, okay. Although this process is very long for Lu Huaxing, for the people around it is just a moment, a gap between two tricks. After Zhang Zhi fell to the ground, the unscrupulous young man at the scene immediately began to whisper. Lu Huaxing could see Deng Jun in the crowd quietly retreating to the back. So, I mean I am the boss of all of you now. Lu Huaxing asked tentatively, and the circle of bad boys around looked at each other. Although they didn't want to admit it, no one dared to stand up against it. Okay, then I'll give you the only order. Speaking of this, Lu Huaxing turned to Yang Xiao Xiao behind him unkindly, just starting today, all of you are not allowed to have any contact with Yang Xiao Xiao. I like my life to be able to read files indefinitely, please bookmark, my life can be read files infinitely. The literature is updated the fastest. Until returning home, Lu Huaxing couldn't help laughing when recalling the angry expression on Yang Xiaoxiao's face, but it was a good thing from all levels. Yang Xiaoxiao is no longer popular in this school, and she will never interact with her anymore. Everyone regards her as a broom star. It is precisely because of her that she provokes the plague god Lu Huaxing. And Yang Xiaoxiao is separated from the bad group, and it is difficult to communicate with other bad schools. Maybe she can consider doing other business, such as studying. Although after thinking about it a little bit, Lu Huaxing felt that it was impossible, Yang Xiaoxiao was not that kind of personality. Although this girl is a girl, her character is very hard. Even though Lu Huaxing showed an overwhelming fighting ability, Yang Xiaoxiao did not intend to retreat in the slightest. She did not show the slightest fear. Many unscrupulous teenagers present at that time obviously showed a look of fear, because Zhang Zhi was very afraid. Can fight. It is precisely because Zhang Zhi is particularly good at playing that he became the boss of the school's bad, no bad guy in the school can beat him. Therefore, Lu Huaxing did not think that Yang Xiaoxiao would turn his head to study, but would just fight him to the end. But Lu Huaxing doesn't matter because now Yang Xiaoxiao has nothing to intimidate him. Now he is a new campus bully, let alone whether the bad boys will treat him as the boss, at least they won't mess with him again. In this way, Lu Huaxing can concentrate on making his own plans, learn to draw and seduce girls, and make his last year of junior high school as exciting as in the movie, full of unforgettable memories. Why are you back so late today? When he got home, his mother El Yujing asked dissatisfiedly. Today it was our team's turn to clean up, and then two people in the team ran away, so I can only do more. Lu Huaxing said a little tiredly. Although the fight with Zheng Zhi seemed like a spark, it consumed him. A lot of physical strength. It seems that today I can only do some relaxing stretching exercises to relieve muscle fatigue. It's okay, it's a blessing to suffer. Just take exercise. El Yujing comforted, and then walked to the living room with a meal. Okay, go wash your hands and eat. Today is mom's fried tomato and eggs. It's better than your dad's fried. After the meal, Lu Huaxing did his homework first, which took almost an hour, but after he finished it he read a file, and returned to an hour before, it only took ten minutes to fill in the answers so he saved some time can watch TV. Ah, I miss it. Lu Huaxing couldn't help sighing as he watched the Little Dragon Club on TV. Many animations from childhood have become classic memories when he grows up. He also spent a lot of time trying to relieve, but such old resources are really hard to find. To be able to watch it again now is really a blessing for him as an otaku. But his dad was not very satisfied, and asked angrily, 
Have you finished your homework? Just watch TV. Here. Lu Waxing handed over the workbook, and his dad took it and checked it, now his dad pays more attention to his study. After he got to high school, his dad was tired of socializing because of his job promotion. I rarely care about him anymore. Dog stuff, the writing is so sloppy, I want to practice running before I learn how to walk. Lu Swipin said angrily. But after checking, the answer was indeed no problem, and he could only let Lu Huaxing go to watch TV. The day after tomorrow, Lu Huaxing said lazily. His dad had a straightened face and was going to ask then you are still here watching TV and not going to review, but Lu Huaxing preempted him and said, this time too. Not to mention too much, let's take the top three in the class. Okay. Lu Swipin was angry and funny, and seemed to think Lu Huaxing's personality had changed a little. This is also inevitable. After all, Lu Huaxing's actual age is almost 30 years old. Before returning, he spent a few years studying and just reading files, so his mental age is older than his actual age before returning. However, from the point of looking excited while watching cartoons, his dad thought he was indeed a kid so he didn't say much. The next morning, he also got up early, went downstairs and ran for 40 minutes in the morning, then went home to take a shower, and then rode to school. When leaving the house, Yang Ying waited for him downstairs, sitting in the car hanging around and looking like he was even more manly than him. Slow to death. Yang Ying asked dissatisfiedly, squinting at him, I will be late for class five minutes later. Oh. It doesn't matter if you are late occasionally. Lu Waxing said disapprovingly, pushing the car forward, and then took out some cards from his arms. Hey, these are all my extra cards. Let me change it. They are very popular at this time to collect cards by eating crispy noodles. The boys in the class more or less collect cards. Yang Ying is an accident because she is the only girl who collects. And she is very popular among the girls in the class, and the cards drawn by the girls will be given to her. Therefore, she is the big man with the most cards in the class. Of course, Lu Waxing didn't want cards, but just exchanged feelings with her. After all, the communication between the little ghosts was based on this. And Yang Ying took the card and took a look, then sneered, that's it. I have all of them but I can give you a few more cards. I'll talk about it when I get to school. Let's hurry now. What is today? Use morning study. After riding on the road, Yang Ying smiled and said, Hey, come to my house to play a game console this Sunday. Don't talk about the machine, civilized you, me and him. Lu Waxing muttered softly with a dry smile, but no one at their age noticed this and Yang Ying didn't even realize what was wrong with this sentence. The previous fighting primitive hadn't fought many times. This time it happened to take the monthly exam on Friday. After the exam, there was no homework on Saturday and Sunday. We had a good afternoon and tried to clear it. Yang Ying said full of spirit. Does it matter? Your father doesn't object. Lu Waxing asked worriedly, Yang Ying's father, Yang Zixiong, is still very strict with her. After all, he is a parent. Seeing his children addicted to games, who wouldn't say a word? It doesn't matter, isn't it summer vacation? We went to school to make up lessons. Yang Ying replied nonchalantly. While chatting, the two also came to the school. As soon as he entered the school, Lu Waxing realized that something was wrong. Many people around him seemed to be afraid of him. It was obvious that those people were not bad boys. He estimated that not all of the people who stayed on the scene to watch a good show yesterday afternoon were bad, or friends who were bad and some ordinary students, they spread the matter among the students. Therefore, most people know that Lu Waxing is now the school's new bad boss. It's so embarrassing. Lu Waxing couldn't help thinking to himself. I just want to go to school honestly. I always feel that those people's eyes are a little wrong. Yang Ying discovered this and said suspiciously. However, 
it is ridiculous that the person who should know this thing the most, they do not know. Before Lu Huaxing entered the class, a group of boys stared at him aggressively, like a dozen people. Basically, those individuals who hated Lu Huaxing were all there. Chen Liang and Zhou Baoyi who were taught by him yesterday afternoon were also listed. Those who did not come were the ones who witnessed him fighting with Deng Jun a few days ago. School is over today, the school's hexagonal pavilion garden is waiting. At this time, a boy who was about the same height as Lu Huaxing came forward and patted him on the shoulder and smiled. This boy is called Luo Yang, his facial features are fairly marked, his figure is slightly thin, and he is white and tender with a little fleshy temperament, but it is a pity that this bite has not been popular this year. From the first day Lu Huaxing entered junior high school and the day of military training, the two of them were at odds. The two had a fight during military training, and Luo Yang was also a student with poor grades, so Lu Huaxing, who hated good students, became more and more hostile. It seems that none of the boys in their class knew that he was the new boss. Come again. Lu Huaxing asked with some dissatisfaction, I have been home after school for three days in a row. Can you let me watch a cartoon? Come on, while class is not in session yet, let's solve the problem now, right? It's not surprising that the boys in their class didn't know about this. To be honest, the boys in their class were really fishing. Not to mention the poor study, the relationship with the bad is not very good, at most, it is to pay the bad guys to beat the people who are looking upset. It is precisely because of this that their news is so unclear. Wo Yang said impatiently, don't bullshit, you will be dead if you dare to leave then. Lu Huaxing rolled his eyes and sighed, but he could only admit, this incident will come sooner or later. The good news is that the group of rabies in their class will be taught a lesson this afternoon, and they should be completely cleaned up in the future. No one will mess with him. Moreover, Lu Huaxing felt better when he saw Yang Xiao Xiao who was sitting on the seat holding his arms and staring at him angrily. He happily stepped forward and smiled at Yang Xiao Xiao, oh, classmate Yang Xiao Xiao came so early today? Isn't it because no one is playing with you so you can only come to the classroom earlier? That's good too. Read the book. Have you learned something? Yang Xiao Xiao bit his lower lip and glared at him, then opened the book and stood on the table to block him, not wanting to look at him anymore. I like my life to be able to read files indefinitely, please bookmark, my life can be read files infinitely. The literature is updated the fastest. When I was studying in the morning, the students in the class were afraid of Yu because they were studying English early, so everyone came very early. After he you came to the classroom, it was rare for the English class representative to read it today. Instead, he pointed to Lu Huaxing and said, Lu Huaxing, today you come to read it with everyone. Lu Huaxing actually felt a little embarrassed, but still stood up, opened the textbook and started reading. His English is very fluent, but the students in the class don't give face to face, especially the boys, so the voice in class is very small but Lu Huaxing didn't mind, and read it for himself. To change the usual situation, He Yu had lost her temper a long time ago when she saw this situation, but today she unexpectedly didn't say anything, instead she was enjoying herself. It wasn't until Lu Huaxing finished reading an article that He Yu explained, you have to read it as proficiently as Lu Huaxing. You know, he has a British accent, which is different from a normal American accent. Everyone the British accent is called the gentleman's accent. It sounds more elegant than the American accent, right? People who like English will find it very enjoyable. But he used behavior just caused the boys in the class to hate him even more. When they were studying in the morning next morning, those people said something cynic and sarcasm, have you heard? You all have to speak British accents like Lu Waxing. What gentleman's accent? the eunuch's accent is almost the same. It has to be like a eunuch. Stupid. Maybe he you likes him like this? That furious old lady, haha. Lu Waxing heard what they said, but he didn't care, and didn't want to get angry about this little thing. Anyway, 
he would have to stop after school today, so he just closed the book with a smile, and then gave his homework. At the same table Chin Yulu. Today's Chin Yulu is also very cute. The sky blue short sleeve t-shirt and denim cropped trousers highlight her symmetrical and slender figure. The small feet under the sandals are white and tender and delicate. Everything is so perfect, as if according to Lu Waxing's aesthetics. Tailored. How did you solve this problem? Chin Yulu looked through Lu Waxing's exercises and asked curiously. The last problem of yesterday's math homework was indeed a bit difficult. It would be particularly troublesome to solve the problem with their current junior high school mathematics. It needs to repeat the calculation many times, but it is easy to use the calculus solution. Of course, using calculus to solve problems like this will not get a score, and it will cause people to doubt. Therefore, Lu Waxing first solves the problem by calculus, and then uses the process of calculus to solve the problem in the mathematics in the book. Knowledge reappears. Oh, I asked my elder sister who went to high school, she is also the bully in the class. Lu Waxing replied. Why do you count this here? Chin Yulu asked, pointing to his workbook, tilting her head as if she had specially shown her perfect profile to Lu Waxing. Lu Waxing really couldn't help but want to leave her pink and white. A kiss on his little cheek. He hesitated whether to kiss directly now and read the file back, but he gave it up after thinking about it. The fruit of victory is the most delicious, and that day will come sooner or later, so bear with it. Lu Waxing persuaded herself, and then explained to Chin Yulu how to solve this problem. Chin Yulu widened her beautiful eyes a little unconvinced from the side. Why? Stare your beautiful eyes so wide. Lu Waxing couldn't help joking. Nothing. Chin Yulu whispered, but Lu Waxing knew that she would not admit defeat. She was a very strong girl. Before that, Lu Waxing's performance had been inferior to her, but now she has a tendency to catch up with her, which made her feel. Crisis. After finishing this topic, it was time for class, and it was announced that they would also start today's first physics class after class. The physics teacher is another teacher that the students in their class are particularly afraid of. This is a male teacher named Zhang Yan. First of all, he has a fierce appearance. Although his head is not particularly strong, his expression is very stern, and his eyes are fierce and unsmiling. Secondly, he is the former dean of teaching and the current vice principal. Currently serving as their physics teacher. However, Lu Waxing is still thinking about his own business, it is a pity that he has learned so much knowledge back to the present, but so far the most useful thing is free fighting. Speaking of it, after he came back, he was just fighting with various people, but in fact he still has a lot of skills, such as Michelin chef level cooking skills, such as 10th level piano playing level, etc., which made him feel a little disappointed. But thinking about it, there are no occasions to show this aspect, so I can only wait for the opportunity. Immediately after the summer supplementary class is over, there will be an evening self-study in the third grade, when everyone has to eat in school, and Lu Waxing can take the opportunity to show off his cooking skills. And in December, they might show off his other skills at the 1 or 29th party at their school. Before that, all he could do was to honestly increase his favorability. Why have you been in a daze in class recently? Can you take the exam like this? Chin Yulu frowned and asked during the break. Lu Waxing looked at her with a smile and said, Don't worry, I'm in a daze because I already understand the knowledge. Don't believe me, let's take a look at the next monthly exam. I promise to be better than you in the exam. Yo! The corner of Chin Yulu's mouth raised slightly, her smile is actually very beautiful, with the charm of an oriental beauty, but her character is not linked to this image, it's such a big story, I don't have to pass the exam. Cry. Lu Waxing just smiled and said nothing. He had just returned from reading files for two days, so he was not in a hurry. There was still a lot of time to slowly get closer to Qin Yulu. 
Although he and Qin Yulu were classmates since the third grade of elementary school, the exchanges between them were not as much as expected. The main reason was that Lu Huaxing was too stupid. Not only did he not dare to pursue it, but would deliberately avoid it. After all, they are too young, and they are very ignorant of emotional matters. Whether Lu Huaxing or Qin Yulu, the two are avoiding each other more or less. Lu Huaxing likes Qin Yulu, and Qin Yulu, maybe because he realizes that he likes her. Therefore, this time Lu Huaxing has to take his time and increase the relationship between them bit by bit. But the closest problem to him now is the appointment with the hexagonal pavilion after school. In fact, the hexagonal pavilion is a community garden behind their school. There is a hexagonal pavilion in the middle of the garden, which is called the hexagonal pavilion by the students of this school. However, no one in this community will come here at all. Generally, boys are singled out. Or gang fights and the like will be around here. Lu Huaxing didn't want to go, he hadn't returned home on time for two consecutive days, and he had found all the excuses he could make. Besides, he still wants to go home with Qin Yulu. He is entangled and fights by these little bunnies every day. Can he chase after his sister? When it was time for school, Lu Huaxing had just stood up, and a boy sitting in the group next to him came up and grabbed his clothes, let's go Lu Huaxing, go to the hexagonal pavilion. This boy is called Xiao Yangjian, a sports committee member in the class, but he is thin and weak, and not tall. He looks like a very well-behaved and quiet boy, and his character is indeed not very lively and a little shy, but the relationship with the boys in the class is good. Seeing Xiao Yangjian, Lu Huaxing felt so angry. He and Xiao Yangjian are elementary school classmates. The two don't say how good the relationship is, at least they have no grudges. Xiao Yangjian's grades can't be said to be jealous of him, but at the moment, he is really angry with the group of boys and came here to stop him. Lu Huaxing became more and more angry. He threw away his hand and said, Don't worry, I didn't plan to run. Today, I'll just settle the bill with you, so don't run, wait until I'm done. It's your turn for those little rascals. Seeing a trace of panic flashed across Xiao Yangjian's face, Lu Huaxing sneered, What are you panicking? Hey! Dare to come here to stop me, and dare not fight with me. With that said, Lu Huaxing grabbed Xiao Yangjian by the collar and gritted his teeth and said, you have chosen the side from the moment you stood in front of me. You chose to stand opposite me. In that case, you will have to bear it. If you please others like a pug, you don't have to take risks. There is nothing so good in this world. Xiao Yangjian pushed away his hand a little angrily, and said in a bad mood, You have the ability to talk about it. Lu Huaxing sneered, getting more and more angry as he thought about it and secretly decided that none of the boys in the class today would be spared, and they would beat them all. But at this time Qin Yulu poked him hard with a pen behind him, are you going to fight with someone again? No, they beat me, I let them beat, and then reason with them. Lu Huaxing said a little bit irritably, but he regretted it when he said it. This matter has nothing to do with Qin Yulu, why should he anger her? Qin Yulu was also a little angry, pouting and glaring at him, passing by him angrily. Lu Huaxing complained a little secretly, but fortunately he had the ability to read files, so he returned to Qin Yulu when he spoke. But this question is actually difficult to answer. After thinking about it, he said seriously, ULU, many questions in life are different from doing test papers, and some things have no correct answers. I know fighting is not good but as a man chooses to escape. The problem is not right. This matter must be resolved, otherwise they will be ridiculed by others, and they will continue to entangle. Can you understand what I mean? Tisk. Qin Yulu frowned, then passed him angrily and left the classroom. Oh, it's all these bastards. Lu Huaxing thought to himself through gritted teeth, I will not beat you to death today. As a result, Lu Huaxing and the boys in his class came to the hexagonal pavilion. Basically, 
all the people who had a bad relationship with him came today. Only the three who saw him fight with Deng Jun that day did not come. Come on! Lu Huaxing angrily threw his school bag into the pavilion aside, don't waste your time, I rush home to eat. Let's go together. I like my life to be able to read files indefinitely, please bookmark, my life can be read files infinitely. The literature is updated the fastest.